Good morning children. Now we know what are acidic, basic and neutral substances. So let us learn about indicators. Now we know few acids as well as bases are dangerous and can even burn our skin. So we cannot taste all the substances to know whether it is acidic or basic in nature. Then how do we know that a substance is acidic or basic? Let us see. We gently remove stain from clothes by rubbing soap on it. But your mother doesn't remove turmeric stain that way. Do you know why? If we try to remove turmeric stain this way, then that stain will change color from yellow to red. Then if we rub lemon onto it, then that red stain will regain yellow color that is it becomes yellow again strange isn't it let me explain as we know soap is basic in nature and the lemon contains citric acid the turmeric stain turns into red when it comes in contact with the basic soap now the acid in the lemon destroys the base effect and the turmeric stain becomes yellow again. Same way some other natural complex substances change their color when they come in contact with basic or acidic substances and these substances are called indicator. Thus an indicator helps us to identify acidic or basic substances without the need of tasting them. And here we can say turmeric is an indicator. You know the most common indicator used in labs is the litmus either in form of strips of paper or in the form of solution. Litmus is extracted from lichens plant in the cold tundra region. If we add litmus to the distilled water the solution will remain purple only that is it won't change its color. As we know, distilled water is neither acidic nor basic. Hence, distilled water is called the neutral substance. Thus, indicator doesn't show any color change when it comes in contact with the neutral substances. So, the general color of litmus when it comes in contact with neutral substance remains purple. When the blue litmus comes in contact with acidic substances, like the lemon it turns into red amazing isn't it just a simple litmus paper strip can help us identify the nature of substances but when the red litmus comes in contact with basic substances like soap it turns into blue can we make a natural indicator at home yes we can make a natural indicator at home. Collect some hibiscus flowers commonly known as the china rose or the good health petals and add them to the boiling water for some time and then strain out the petals. This colored solution can be used as an indicator. Same way indicators can also be produced from brightly colored parts of the plants such as roots for example the beetroot, stems, as we saw turmeric etc. If we add basic substance like soap, baking soda into this red solution which we obtain from the china rose petals it will turn green. And if you add acidic substance into this red solution it will turn magneta. And lastly water indicators, solutions of substances that show different colors in acidic, basic and neutral solutions are called indicators. So that was all about acid and bases. Bye bye children.